first thing we're going to look at is something called a nasopharyngeal airway. This is a soft, flexible rubber tube, and it's meant to kind of open the airway in patients who are uh, a little bit obtundent. Our most common indication for this would be maybe an intoxicated patient who is, just needs a little bit of airway assistance. So what you do is you just lube up this plastic um, airway, nasal airway, and you just slide it into the nose, and it should go in fairly easily all the way down. And that's pretty much it. And that way when you're placing oxygen on the patient, their airway is a little bit more open. Okay, for the more obtundent patient, we use something called an oral pharyngeal airway. And as you can see, this is a piece of hard plastic as opposed to this flexible rubber. And this is really only tolerated for patients who are really obtundent. It's a way to open the airway and get the tongue out of the back of the airway. Basically, you place the patient in a sniffing position and you place it in the mouth all the way till the end. The main um, thing you need to make sure of is that you're not pushing the tongue back when you place the oral airway in. So again, you push the patient in a sniffing position and you place the plastic oral airway there. And that way, when you bag your patient or you have oxygen on your patient, their airway is more open.